Cedric Bird back to return a kick. He's a defensive back, and the kick is a bit short. Bounces against Bird. Bird picks it up at about the 20-yard line. He goes up the middle of the field, and he crosses the 30, and ends up at around the 34 to 35-yard line. Shotgun formation to begin for Ryan Singer, and there'll be a lot of that today. Put a man in motion. And the first play of the game is a running play that gets him a couple of yards up the middle. So Bird does uh, move up a little bit. On at eight yards to go. The ball at the 36, 37 yard line. Singer to throw, throws in the right flat. And he had a receiver open. Joey Gilkey was uh, open at about the 42. The field to the left is Lance Bird, but he goes in motion and takes an end around handoff from the left to right. And he gets down to the 45 yard line, but there is a flag on the play. Backfield this time, Seth Moorhead, Seth Moreland, and back to throw. He's going to get a sack. He gets away, surprisingly enough, and throws it away. Back to throw, Singer. Singer in the shotgun. Throws to the right side, has a receiver who gets smashed the minute he catches the ball. Bears are right there. Averaging 38 yards a punt so far out of Greenville, South Carolina. Line drive kind of punt. This one is going to get into the end zone, so the ball will come out to the 20-yard line, and the Bears will get their first possession. First and 10 at the 20-yard line. Will Cap is back. He's in fullback right now, and it's a play fake, and a hand or pitch out to Cap on the left sideline. He's across the 30, 35, 40. He gets stopped out of bounds, they say, at the 36-yard line. This time a handoff. Cefeli sweeps to the right, bounces off of one man, and then they gang up on him and bring him down. So only a one-yard gain in that play is a tackle made by Brian Davis. Second and nine. Nobody in the backfield, but over center for Maynard. So he sends uh, Cefeli out as a receiver out to the left side. Quick pass to the right sideline. Keenan Allen. Allen makes one move, beats one man. Oh, excuse me, Marvin Jones. Marvin Jones makes the catch and goes up the right side and gets out to the 50-yard line. Over center for Maynard. Maynard with a handoff and a flag on the play. Uh, Cefeli tries to sweep to the outside, doesn't get very far. Shotgun formation for Maynard. Maynard throws a quick pass to the right sideline to Marvin Jones, and Jones is tackled almost immediately at the 36-37 yard line. Shotgun formation for Maynard. Maynard's on the right hash, steps up in the pocket, throws deep over the middle, incomplete. Maynard's pass is incomplete. Maynard takes the snap, looks around, has to run out of trouble, goes to the left, he decides to throw it to the left sideline, and did he catch it in Browns? Yes, Calvin, but there's a flag on the play. Maynard's pass is complete. Anger will punt from around his 27-yard line. They didn't change anything with the looking at the replay for whatever reason. Anger, for whatever reason, is hitting all these sideways punts so far this season. 
This one is a great pick. It's going to go down to the 11 yard line. So uh, he may be quite good for them over the next several years. He's just a sophomore. Penalty is a five yard penalty to the six yard line. No score in the first quarter. It's a pitch and sweeping to the right side and getting out to maybe the 11 yard line is about it on this one. Five yard gain on the play out to the 11. Second and 10 at that point. And clearly a broken play because as the quarterback singer looked for somebody to hand off to, there was nobody there. And movement on the left side of the line by the left tackle, Tim Fowler. Outside the six. Back to throw, Singer is in the end zone as he gets ready to throw, and he is pulled down at the four yard line. A couple of steps up, Marvin Jones is gonna take it right about midfield at the 49, moves to his left, beats one man on speed, flag on the play, he's still running down to the 20, and is stopped downfield and going out of bounds. up the middle and is dragged down as he reaches maybe the 46 yard line it's our first look at Bigelow Bigelow is on the backfield for Cal comes in motion to the right side Maynard throws to Bigelow on the right side takes the ball runs past one man runs past another then is pulled down as he reaches the 33 or 34 yard line tackled by LJ Perry with help from Josh Pope gain on the play of 11 yards as a true freshman because of that, but they must feel he's totally healthier. They wouldn't do it. Hand off to Cefeli. Cefeli bursts up the middle. He looks like he's gone to the left sideline to the 15 to the 10. They got an angle on him. He may not get there, and they bring him down at the 10-yard line. Easy Cefeli started up the middle, made a nice spin move. And now C.J. Anderson's in. Maynard in the shotgun. Hand off, up the middle, into the end zone. Touchdown, Bears. Anderson carries it in for California. The J.C. All-American. Here's the extra point. It is up and it is good. And so the extra point, good by Tavecki. Left foot kicker comes up to the 30-yard line. Puts his foot into it. And this one will come down at about the five-yard line. So bringing it back up and getting out to the 21 or 22-yard line. That's about it on the return. Shotgun formation, hand off to the running back, goes into the middle of the line and takes a beating. Two to the left side, keeps a man in the backfield. Takes the snap, sets up quickly, throws, intercepted, right into the hands of Katus. Katus coming back, gets to the 10, flag on the play down to the 8. And there is a penalty flag, maybe on the return, we'll see which way it goes. Maynard with a handoff. Cefeli crashes into the line, goes over right guard, tries to push his way to the goal line. Eye formation, cap the fullback. Cefeli the running back. Miller in motion. Handoff. Cefeli should get in, does. Touchdown, Bears. Native of Italy puts it up in the air. It is up and it is good. Bears go up by a score of 14 to nothing here with. 4.23 to go in the first period. Tavecchio picking off from our left to our right from the 30. Short kick coming down to the near side to Bird. Bird now heads to the far side of the field, though, trying to sweep out to the right and is brought down as he crosses the 30. And it's a handoff into the line to Seth Moreland, a 5'9", 180 sophomore. The Braveheart kind of look, but he doesn't look like Mel Gibson to me. Pass to the right sideline is incomplete. They try to throw to Patrick McCoy. Then the man in motion to the right side. Singer back to throw. Now running out of trouble, running into trouble. He'll take a sack. Bears go get him, bring him down. Patrick Morgano is their putter. It's a good kick. My goodness, in fact, an over-the-shoulder catch needed by Marvin Jones. Jones starts to come up the right side of the field, beats one man, jumps over another, and then is brought down 
at the 45-yard line. Zach Maynard working in the shotgun. Keeps a man in the backfield, Cefeli. It's a pitch to Cefeli. Sweeps to the left. He's got Schwartz in front of him to block for him, and he gets two or three yards around the left corner. Shotgun for Maynard. One man in the backfield. And it's a pitch to the right sideline and getting upfield to the 45, down to the 40. As the Bears get upfield a little bit is Brendan Bigelow. Does that mean we're at Winchester Cathedral or something? Here's a rolling out to the left side and with the ball is C.J. Anderson now after a pitch and was cut off after just a one-yard gain. Shotgun formation. Anderson in the backfield. Quick pass in the, the right flat. Caught by Keenan Allen and tackled as he makes the catch and brought down. Back to throw Maynard. Maynard tries to throw and has it slapped away. Nice defensive play. Good move. Defensively by Josh Pope. Bears have a fourth down and three to go from the 33 yard line. Maynard shotgun keeps a man in the backfield, Anderson. And a pass over the middle is complete, and they got the first down. Tight end Anthony Miller picks up about five yards. Maynard with a handoff into the line to CJ, who tries a submarine straight ahead. That's the end of the first quarter.